Okay, so I'm recording this video right now. My name's Matthew Jester, and I'm going to go ahead and talk about what hypnosis is and describe some of the scientific details behind it. First, I just want to show, I, uh, this is the certificate of completion for the hypnosis course that I completed. Rather comprehensive course, Mac, Mike Mandela Hypnosis Academy is uh, where I got the certification from. So anyways, <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and just go over some basic details just so that people can understand the basics of what hypnosis is. So what is hypnosis? There are different theories of hypnosis and I'll be referencing two of them in this video briefly. Since learning the science of hypnosis and how it works can provide ac adequate understanding of the subject regardless of the theory. So the first theory is that hypnosis, I'm sorry, like this kind of sounds like a grammatical issue. Um, and I'm not going to be like, okay with having this type of problem. I'm looking for. I'm gonna put that word in. So I mean, this is a very consistent issue that I've had ever since I got hypnotized. Um, it's uh, been very apparent in almost everything that I've been writing ever since I got hypnotized. And I mean, uh, you know, like there, of course, uh, just making sure to watch my video um, entitled "Hypnosis Abuse and Inhibition." Um, let's see, I'm going to write a quick sticky note. <sighs> <sighs> Please watch my video. Hypnosis, abuse, and speech inhibition. Oh. Let me see here. I'm gonna check. So I'm gonna be um, I'm gonna be doing a few different. I'm gonna be doing at least three or four videos. Probably. I'm gonna. I'm trying to do more videos. The hypnosis won't allow me to. So I'm probably going to do it anyways. This was one of my reviews. There we go. There it is. Hypnosis, abuse, and inhibition. Oh my god. That's also another problem because it's not supposed to be a hypnosis, abuse, and inhibition. It's supposed to be hypnosis, abuse, and speech inhibition. So I'm going to go ahead and fix that now. Hypnosis, abuse, and speech inhibition. So I have that now. Great. So 
So it's hypnosis, abuse, abuse and speech inhibition, and it is not hypnosis, abuse, and inhibition of speech either, which I mean is a nice thing to clarify. interesting okay anyway so that's done and out of the way All right. oh that's right that's right I should include that too maybe I'll just have a general intro for all my videos Hold on just a second. So I don't mean to bore you all with this. General intro. Oh. Please watch my video entitled Hypnosis, abuse, and speech inhibition. Mm. Okay, and then other than that, uh, oh yeah, that's right, I want to say I'm going to be leaving a link in the description. I will leave a link in the description. Ah. So sorry about that. Anyways, um, the hypnosis is making me feel back pain. I described that in that video. So please watch my video entitled Hypnosis, Abuse, and Speech Inhibition. I will leave a link in the description. Blah, blah, blah. All right, anyways. Mm. Sorry about that. <clears throat> Um, I'm also going to want to make, let's see, uh, laws, and uh, so these are going to be petitions. I will also leave additional. Links. Oh, sorry. I'll also leave additional uh, links in the description. Of my other videos. Of other relevant videos. There we go. Great. So 
Sorry about that. Big noses. Mm. Hmm. Alright, uh, that's, that's pretty satisfying. Okay, that's very satisfying. Oh, okay. Anyways, um, I'm going to go ahead and upload this video too. But wait, there was something that I wanted to fix. I remember. Because I'm pretty irritated right now. Oh. And I noticed that, um, so, like, I will be using this as evidence, too. Um, you know, just very apparent type of thing, right? So, anytime I am, uh, you know, like, it's a, I noticed that I would be stuttering over this, like, specific cue, cued words. Sorry about that. Um, in my videos. So, make sure to watch that video that I'm specifying the... Hypnosis, abuse, and speech inhibition. And uh, just uh, pay attention if I say, if I stutter over it because, right? So let's say I'm going to try this one more time real quick. There are different theories of hypnosis, and I will only be referencing two of them in this video briefly. Because learning the science of hypnosis and how it works can provide an adequate understanding of the subject regardless of the theory. Hold on just a second. There's just something that doesn't seem right about that. Um, there are different theories of hypnosis, and I will only be referencing two of them in this video. Hold on a second. I'm using this as evidence too because like this is not a hard thing to comprehend and how I raise my voice please watch that video that I was specifying So I'm going to try to change some words here and see if it sounds right to me. I mean, I um, don't exactly think that there's necessarily a grammatical error in here. Um, and how it works can provide an adequate understanding of the subject. I guess I can go ahead and say, um, Provide an adequate understanding of the subject. Or I can even just say hypnosis. So 
So there are different theories of hypnosis and I will only be referencing two of them in this video briefly and I will be reference and I will be only re and I will only be referencing two of them in this video briefly because learning the science of hypnosis and how it works can provide an adequate understanding It might be because I'm not specifying what the adequate understanding is for, but I will go ahead and specify here how hypnosis works. There are different theories of hypnosis and I will only be referencing two of them in this video briefly. will be oh no that works that works briefly refer reference two of them in this video Dang. And I will briefly reference two of them in this video. Because learning the science of hypnosis and how hypnosis works can provide an adequate understanding. of hypnosis regardless of the theory. I could say that. Or do I want to say for these videos? In this video, because learning the science of hypnosis and how hypnosis works can provide an adequate understanding. There are different theories of hypnosis and I will briefly reference two of them in this video because learning the science of hypnosis and how hypnosis works can provide an adequate understanding of hypnosis. Um, can provide an adequate understanding regardless of the theory. Or I'll just say of hypnosis regardless of the theory. There we go, yeah. So let me see. For a basic there we go there we go there we go this I mean regardless of the theory There we go, there we go. OK, 
Okay, there are different theories of hypnosis, and I will briefly reference two of them in this video because learning the science of hypnosis and how hypnosis works can provide a great basic understanding of hypnosis regardless of the theory. There are different theories of hypnosis, and I will briefly reference two of them in this video because learning the science of hypnosis and how hypnosis works can provide a basic understanding of hypnosis regardless of the theory. Okay, let's see. The first theory is that hypnosis is the same thing as trance. Depending on how you define hypnosis, you could use the tra um, terms hypnosis and trance interchangeably. Although I personally differentiate as not all trances will increase an individual's susceptibility to accepting post-hypnotic suggestions or hypnotic commands like his hypnosis is intended to. Human Givens theory states that hypnosis is any artificial means of, access of accessing the REM state, which is naturally active while dreaming. This theory of hypnosis would provide a logical e explanation for all the phenomena that is associated with hypnosis. Okay, then hypnosis terms. Uh, let's see, hypnosis definition, somnambulism. Somnambulism is the medical terminology for sleepwalking, and in hypnosis is a deep stage of trance that mimics a very similar appearance to sleepwalking, which is why this, this stage of trance was named somnambulism. This is the stage of trance known to produce the most profound hypnotic effects and is when post hypnotic suggestions are primarily given. Let me see. Um, uh, okay, so post suggestions. post suggestions are the instructions and or commands given to subjects while in somnambulism that are carried out upon waking from trance or after specified hypnotic cues or after a specified date and or time. Okay. And then getting into the critical faculty and I already reviewed all that before the, in the last video, so great. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get started on this. I'm going to upload this video.